Welcome to Byte Further. In today's video, you'll learn how to fix Wi-Fi issues on iPhone 17, iPhone 17 Pro, iPhone 17 Pro Max or iPhone Air. So, you've just got the new iPhone 17, but now unexpectedly experience Wi-Fi connectivity issues. The Wi-Fi is constantly dropping in and out during the setup process or disconnects itself after unlocking. Also, some users from the official forum complain they find the problem as the wireless car play disconnects itself intermittently and won't reconnect unless the car is shut off and restarted. It's really frustrating when the brand new iPhone 17 won't connect to Wi-Fi. The common reasons include the router glitches, weak network signals, internet service outage, corruptions on network-related settings, problematic or outdated operating system, broken Wi-Fi antenna, and so on. The good news is that we found some useful solutions to resolve the Wi-Fi connection issues and get your iPhone 17 back online. Don't forget to give this video a like or a super thanks if this video helps move past the initial setup screen. Now, let's start. Step 1. Shut down the router and modem then turn them back on. Let's start with restarting the router and modem. This helps re-establish a fresh connection to your internet service provider to optimize the bandwidth and improve network speed. To do that, disconnect the power cable from both router and modem and wait for at least 30 seconds. Next, plug the power cord back into the router and modem. When you see a solid light, it means that they're successfully powered on and connected. Meanwhile, it makes sense to make sure the router runs the latest firmware and the ISP has no internet service outage. When all is done, reconnect the Wi-Fi on your iPhone 17, iPhone 17 Pro or iPhone 17 Pro Max. Wait and see if the connection works and stays stable and you can access the internet. Step 2. Restart your iPhone 17. If your iPhone 17 is still not connecting to Wi-Fi, attempt to reboot the device itself. It helps clear temporary glitches that may affect Wi-Fi connectivity. To restart your iPhone 17, press and hold a volume button and a power button at the right side. When a power off slider appears, move it to the right and let the phone switch off. After around 30 seconds, press and hold the power button at the right side again until the Apple logo pops up. Then, all that's left to do is to wait for the device to boot up. Remember to test if your iPhone 17 has a solid Wi-Fi connection without dropping out after the restart. Step 3. Toggle on and off the airplane mode. Turning on airplane mode can cut all wireless connections for a while to reduce interference among each wireless signal. Then, switching it off can force the device to search for the same network again, which will come up with stronger signals and refresh network configuration. If you've not tried this trick, follow these steps to attempt. From the top right corner, slide your finger downwards to open the control center. Locate the flight mode icon and tap it to turn it on. The icon should be in orange. After a few seconds, tap the icon again to turn it off, then return to the home screen. Hope the Wi-Fi connection issues can be fixed this time. Step 4. Remove any VPN files and apps. Have you installed VPN in your old device before transferring to the new iPhone 17? If so, when transferring from the old phone to the new iPhone 17, the VPN file could be damaged due to the changes on the phone's operating system, hardware and the network. Finally, your iPhone 17 doesn't connect to Wi-Fi. The solution is to remove the VPN profile then delete the app. To do that, navigate to the Settings app. Tap on General. Choose VPN and Device Management. Select VPN. Locate the added VPN files and tap the I icon next to it. On the next page, hit Delete VPN and Confirm. Then, go back to the home screen and delete all the VPN-related apps. Once done, reconnect the Wi-Fi network and see if the connection works properly. If you still want to use VPN, just restart the phone and then add them back, enabling the VPN to configure itself to the new hardware, OS and network. Step 5. Make sure the Wi-Fi's low data mode is not selected. If you find the Wi-Fi will not stay connected to iPhone 7 or the connection is extremely slow, it's possible that the low data mode is turned on from the connected Wi-Fi network. This feature will set the restrictions on data usage, leading to slow connectivity on the internet and inability to connect to most apps. If you suspect this is the cause when your iPhone 17 won't connect to a Wi-Fi network, just follow these steps to disable the feature. Head to the Settings app and tap Wi-Fi. 
Locate the Wi-Fi network that your iPhone 17 won't connect to and tap the blue info icon next to it. In the next page, find the low data mode option and toggle off its switch. See if the Wi-Fi connectivity is back on your iPhone 17 or iPhone Air and the connection is flawless. Step 6. Forget the connected Wi-Fi network. If the Wi-Fi disconnection still remain on your iPhone 17, the next step should be to forget the connected Wi-Fi then reconnect. Tap to open the Settings app and select Wi-Fi. Tap the blue eye icon next to the Wi-Fi network that your iPhone 17 fails to connect. Then, choose Forget this network. To confirm, hit Forget. Once that Wi-Fi is removed from the connected networks list, try to reconnect the network, enter the correct password and see if your iPhone 17 connects to Wi-Fi now. Step 7. Reset the network settings. If your iPhone 17 won't detect an internet connection on connected Wi-Fi, it's time to reset all the network settings. Here's a reminder. All the saved Wi-Fi and password, created VPN files, Bluetooth connection and so on will be deleted after resetting the network settings. If you're fine with that, here's how to fix a new iPhone 17 that is not connecting to Wi-Fi. Hit the Settings app. Choose General. Scroll all the way down and select Transfer or Reset iPhone. In the next page, choose Reset from the bottom and hit the Reset Network Settings option. Now, go to Wi-Fi and reconnect the network. The Wi-Fi connectivity should be restored on your iPhone 17 or iPhone Air. Step 8. Get direct support from the store. You should fix iPhone 17 Wi-Fi issues if it's software-related. If not, it determines that there's something wrong with a network or device itself. You can first contact your ISP to check if their server is functioning properly. If you find your new iPhone 17 won't connect to Wi-Fi but other devices will, then don't hesitate going back to the store. As your device is still under warranty, they will help handle the problem by repairing it and changing it to another new one. That's all for how to fix a brand new iPhone 17 not connecting to Wi-Fi. If you find this video helpful, please buy a super thanks for this video and give this video a like. Your support means a lot to us to deliver more useful videos to help those in need. Also, if you have any further questions, feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.